Okay, young people, in reality, there are multiple ways of doing this. But when I solve this problem, I'm going to work with the mixed, the mixed fraction to an improper fraction version of solving this problem. Because it's much easier. All you have to do is know how to multiply and add at the same time. Now, Kevin bought a 7 and 2 thirds inches tall model of the Statue of Liberty. The scale used for the model was 2 thirds inch equals 4 meters. What is the actual height in meters of the Statue of Liberty? Explain how you solve the question. When they say explain how you solve the question, that means show your work. That's just a fancy way of saying show your work. And let me underline that. Underline that to elucidate what I said. This is a longer way of saying show your work. Now, what I have to do in order to make this easier to digest, I have to turn this seven third seven and two thirds into a fraction, into an improper fraction. Let me say his name correctly. In order to do that. I'm going to kind of start from the bottom and multiply the base number, which is the 7. 7 times 3 plus 2. Then I'm going to divide by 3. Notice my denominator stay the same. 7 times 3 is 21 plus 2 over 3. 23 over 3 is the same thing as 7 and 2 thirds. So now we got that. And I'm going to put inches. Again, I don't feel like writing all that stuff, so I'm just going to put I in, to be honest. That's the first step. Now I'm going to do the second step in brown. I have... A rate, two thirds inch equals four meters. So let's go ahead and work with that. I have twenty three over three times four over two-thirds. With multiplying fractions, I can multiply straight across. This means I have 23 times 4. And I could do it similarly to 24 times 4, but I don't know if that's a good idea. You know what? I'm just going to multiply in my head. You know what? Yeah, I could do it similarly to 24 times 4. I know that 24 times 4 is 96 because it takes 96 hours to reach 4 days. So since I have 23 times 4, 23 is 1 below. I'm just going to subtract 4 from 96 and get 92. And a lot of you guys will probably be like, you know what? I'm using a calculator. And... It's not really fine and dandy when you use a calculator, to be honest. That actually slows you down. It's best to know your math. Okay, now I got 2 thirds times 3. That's going to be 2. Let me put my units here. The inches cancel out because you got one inch on the top and another inch on the bottom of a fraction. And then I have meters. So three times two thirds is two. Then I have the meters. 92 divided by two is 46. That's the answer I got.